just fitted a catch can to this Toyota Hilux D4D just so we can sort of catch all the oily fumes that are going in the inlet and make it better so the EGR carbons don't stick. But an interesting observation, because it's all cold this morning, is the amount of water that this catch can's caught. So of course, when things are cold early in the morning, you have a lot of moisture and condensation build up in an engine. That's why short runs are actually no good for engines, period. A longer run, which it gets hot enough, where that moisture will of course evaporate and disappear, is the best thing so short runs you've got to keep your oil changes very very regularly because your oil gets highly contaminated with that oil now you normally wouldn't see this but because it's got a catch can in it i guess we've gone in there and had a little bit of a look and seen all this moisture and water in here but that's really where it's from nothing's leaking it's just cold startup so if you've got a catch can with a lid like this cold morning start it up run it for a few minutes or a 5k run and come back and that's about what we did and it's full of water so you'd probably say it might take a good 15 to 20 k's of hot gases going through here before everything starts to sort of evaporate and dry other than that that's normally going straight into your engine it's also going down past piston rings and everything else and causing corrosion and all sorts of other horrible things so remember those horrible 15,000 k oil changes i think are rubbish i think you certainly should be a maximum 10 and of course those diesel lovers still stick with their good old five. But as far as we're concerned, don't forget your oil changes. Here's a bit of evidence for the day. For more information, go to berrimadiesel.com.